everybody. I am doing some art journaling today. So today I'm going to go in this one and I'm going to pull out, I have several art journaling things I can do in here. So I have this one, this beautiful watercolor from my journal from my friend Pramita. So that's one. And then I have this one. Look at this pretty journal. Isn't this gorgeous? This is also from um, Pramita. So let me just pull that out. Whoops. I think I, yeah, pretty sure. I've got several things in here too that I can use. Um, I'm gonna pull some of these um, out as well. And I have more in here I can use. So I just wanna pull some of this out so that I use it. And let me just put this, somewhere else. So I want to do some journaling and watercolor and stuff in these journals. And um, I did do something here. I put this in here. I thought that I did that actually in this. Um, there's all kinds of things in here to use. I just love this. So I want to do something in here. It's actually the first thing I did in this one, but I want to do um, some more stuff. I'm going to take this clip off so that it does not get all messed up. And um, so this is kind of more like uh, a junk journal. And this is dedicated to my friend Pramita. And then she gave me this one and I want to do um, some, maybe some brush lettering or something in here. I'm not sure yet and I'm just going to keep it uh, side right at the moment while I figure out. But I am going to work on this one. I just love all this stuff. I, I need to start journaling in here too because there is just so much to do. I love this page and I've got all kinds of things and I want to put in this because I like this. Let's hang on there. And make sure I have what I want. Okay, so I'm gonna put this picture in. I got this picture from a friend. And just look at how pretty it is. It's so pretty, I love it. And I was thinking, I, I'm gonna skip around in this journal, actually. So I'm going to look and see, oh, there's so many beautiful things in here. Oh, here we go. This actually might be perfect page for this. I could put this here and then I could do some writing on that. That's one that is beautiful. This one also is very beautiful for this. Oh, decisions, decisions. What shall I do? I think I'll go back to this one. And I'm going to put this on here. Now I've got some artwork on here, so I do want to be careful. And I think what I'm going to do is get down my magazine things, and I'm going to put um, a picture under this. So I have been cutting out magazine pieces like a maniac, for sure. And I want to do a bunch of flowers. I know that my friend Pramita loves flowers. So I just want to pull out some of the pretty flower pictures that I have cut out from actually a seed catalog. And we'll do like our, I want to do a thing like our friendship um, is going to bloom forever. So that's, I think, what I'm going to do. And I'm going to, basically, I am going to collage 
So I'm just going to use glue sticks and I'm going to get uh, these flowers all put down first. Oh, they're just stunning, stunning. And I'm going to go right up to the edge. And I'm just going to kind of, you know, I'm going to put them all around. I've been wanting, dying to work in this thing, this beautiful journal Permita gave me. And I just, you know, and I just haven't taken the time to do it. So this, it's not a reflection on her at all. It's just me. I just um, do another things, you know. And I like to, you know, I want to cherish my friendships because I have like wonderful friendships uh, from the journaling community. And really, Pramita was the first one who invited me to a journaling group. And from there, it just like our friendship took off. And then I got, you know, I became friends with so many other women. And Pramita just introduced me to this whole group of people that I wouldn't have really known about had it not been for her. So I'm thankful for that, but I'm thankful for more than anything for her friendship. We are really kindred spirits and soul sisters, and um, she lives in India. I wish she lived closer because I... I would be so blessed if she lived closer. Can't lie, it would be wonderful. So, let's do this one. Because we would have such a great time together. Getting together for coffee and journaling and just, you know, all kinds of stuff. It, it would really be so wonderful. I'm tempted to just do um, good. I'm actually going to do that as a tip in because I want this whole page to be collaged like this, there. And then I can do this as a tip in, because if I cover that up, look at, I can't see all the gorgeousness of this. And then I can put this one right here, or I can even put it up here, like just glue it at the top of this you know, and um, then I can put something else on the back. I think I might do that. Um, I'm thinking that might be a really good way to do this. So let me think. That means I want something on the back. So I do have some more pictures. So much of my stuff is put away. <coughs> so I just have to like make do with what I have and what I can find that I already have out here. Oh, this would work. Yeah, that would make pretty much perfectly what I want. Okay, so the first thing to do is glue this down. So I'm going to put this here, and then I'm going to flip, I'm going to go right here for this. Okay, and then I'm going to just go here and make sure that gets flattened down nicely. And then I can go in and I can trim some of this off that needs to be trimmed off. Okay, and we're going to 
trim off just at the very top. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna do like, do a whole bunch today to make up for the fact that I'm probably gonna be doing nothing for about five days, you know. And then what I'm gonna do across here is um, a phrase. I have lots of phrases and I'm thinking it would be nice to put one of these across here. So yeah, I did the flowers I wanted to do, so I'm gonna set those aside. I have stuff everywhere, just everywhere. <laughs> um, I uh, always be on the lookout for the presence of wonder. So I'm looking for something that's gonna go all the way across. Because I don't want to have to deal with um, trimming this. So that is my goal. Oops, so close. Okay, there we go. Do a tiny bit of trim. Okay, so there we go. Always be on the lookout for the presence of wonder. And then the picture is still here. And actually, I could just bring it right here with washi and then it'll flip up and you'll just see all those beautiful flowers. So maybe that's what I will do is put some washi there. <clears throat> so I have got some gorgeous washies. Um, many of these I've gotten from my friend, Permita. And I would like to use this one with the hearts. All right. Let me see. Here we go. I can feel it. I know it's here. <laughs> yeah, I think doing it up here is actually better because then I don't cover up any of the picture because I really don't want to cover oops, any of the picture up. And then I have room for some journaling. I want to do some journaling right there and this allows me to do some journaling over on this page. It looks like I need to move this. Oh, I'm okay. Yeah, so this this particular journal that Pramita gave me is really a friendship journal. There. Yeah, so then I can just like bloom forevers. And then all oh, these beautiful, beautiful flowers. And then I uh, would like to put a little bit of washi there as well. Just a pretty light floral print, I think. Here we go. Because I feel like um, I don't want these to come up. So I'm just going to just do a tiny little trim. I haven't journaled in, all, in so many of these things I've gotten and, and it's just like, oh, you know, I have an opportunity today to just really enjoy this journal. And so that's what I'm doing. Just enjoying it. And I absolutely love this page. Oh my goodness, so pretty. And then I can journal there. And I'm all I'm doing is decorating right now. I'm not gonna write 
um, stuff down everywhere. I'm just like doing some decorating. So you see over here, I have the other side um, and I still have enough pictures where I can go ahead and um, put some more flowers in. So I'm gonna do that. And I am just going to do some collaging. Little crazy collaging gonna go on here. That's what's gonna happen. to just cut this one out and do this one different. Okay. I see I will have to come over here and do a little bit of fixing up. Okay, there we go. All right, and then I will have to come over here and as you can see, I need to trim a little. Let's see if I can turn that and just trim off a little bit of this. Okay. There we go. Perfect. All right, so there we have that. And um, I want to put see if there's something else. like a saying or something in here. Oh, let me see what I can find. There is something. I will find it. thinking I'm going to go with this. Okay, so I can put that there, but um, I I kind of need to have something behind it. Not that. 
maybe this. How about this? And I'll just round the corners. And around these corners. I've got stuff all over my desk. <laughs> it's just like disaster queen going on here. It's really, it's craziness. But I want to get a couple pages done because it's just so pretty. And there, and this way it will stand out on here. So, let me take my tape runner. Or my adhesive, or whatever you want to call it. And I'm going to put that right there. There we go. I like that. And then I can write here. So I have this, and that of course was in the earlier time, and this. I'm really, really um, loving this a ton. I love these so much. I cannot wait to think of ways to use them. Um, I really want to do something here. So let me see. I have this piece of acetate, which I would love to use as a beautiful like tip in which means I actually want a different page. Like, oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> that didn't take long, did it? That orange is absolutely perfect for this. So, my friend Jessie sent me all of these beautiful pieces from magazines that she cut out and I am getting to um, use so many of them this because this is just stunning to me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, tape it. I'm not going to tape it. I'm going to use this and it's going to be um, kind of a tip, a tip in, tip up, whatever. Um, you want to call it. So let me trim that. It's so perfect. It's so perfect. Okay. Oop. Have to make sure. I just have this leftover acetate, like I this paper was like packaging really I haven't bought I didn't buy like any acetate or anything but this is just so perfect for here okay and it just like spans perfectly so perfectly and I want to put something right there because see this will lift up and it is so so pretty it's so pretty I am going to put a little bit of washi tape across the top and I have one here that I think will work perfectly as long as I can find the end oh I feel something I had to cut my nails short last night because um, they just got beat up from packing. And of course now, <laughs> now I'm having a hard time because yeah, that was not, not so easy. Fine, I'll just find one that's already like Oh, this is so pretty. Oh my goodness. This is pretty. And I'm going to run this one right 
here. Yeah, perfect. Oh, Pramita, these papers you gave me, um, this, this journal you made me, it's just so pretty. I love this. I really love it. And this means I'm looking for another phrase. I want to put another phrase here. Um, I think I put some phrases where I wasn't supposed to put phrases. Words and phrases and phrases and who knows what else. <laughs> ah. Yeah. Okay. And I want to put one of these on here. So I want to find something. How about this? Oops. I found one I like. And I'm putting this on the acetate, and it says, We are fearless, independent, and original. So that's on here. You lift it up, it's not there. There it is. And I want to stick on um, a couple of stickers that I have. First off will be this bird sticker because it just seems to go so perfectly. Now I have to be sure that I get it um, Yeah, that it stays on the acetate because then it lifts up. I really like that. Oh my goodness. It's perfect. And then I have a butterfly. And I'm going to put that right there. Okay. So there we go. I've got a mess everywhere because I'm actually I'm actually being messy. Can you believe it? Alright, so I like that. Um, I think that turned out really pretty. And like I said, I'm, I'm gonna I want to come back in later and do some of the writing and stuff. But what I wanted to do right now is just do some decorating. Because the decorating is so pretty. And I like it. And I want to put, oh, I want to put this here. This was another card, and actually this looks stunning next to this. I do have to trim it just a little bit, because I do want it to um, fit nicely on the page. So I'm just doing a tiny bit of trimming, because I really don't want to lose very much of the card. Okay. Oh, it's so gorgeous. Seriously. All right, I'm going to take my magazines out again. And I'm, I'm looking for a backdrop just for this. I got all kinds of stuff. So I just need, I just need a backdrop like this right here. Um, it does not matter what this word is or says or anything. That just does not even matter. And this piece of paper is pretty much close to what it needs to be. So I'm going to put it on first um, on part of this. And then I'm going to go like this and then like this. I just realized that I packed away all the rest of this. So if I use this up, I have no more. <laughs> uh, yay, Terry. Okay. Um, and what I think I'm going to do is move this little note card right here. And I'm going to just go ahead and fold this over right here. 
And then I am actually going to make um, a pocket. So, that's kind of a novel, a different, it just occurred to me that then I use the whole thing and I just get to make a pocket, which is really cool. I don't know how much more time I got on this before it turns off on me. My, my phone, because I've cleared enough stuff off of it, will um, record for like half an hour before it shuts off. So I'm hoping it records enough for me to finish this. Okay, so now I have a pocket on this side. See? Perfect. And this comes here. And then what I can do, I think I want to take this up here. This corner. Nope, I don't. Have to use that somewhere else. That means I can put this picture here. So what I'm going to do is just do a little trimming. Okay, just like that. And I'm going to put it right in the middle. Actually, I'm going to do it like a tip in because I really want some multiple surfaces that I can use for things. So actually a tip in would be the best. And so really all I got to do is pick one of these washies to use and I see the perfect one. I want to use for this tip in. And I'm just going to tear it and it's going to go right here and it's going to go right to the edge and then I'm going to flip her over oh I see that I needed to take off whoops some of this okay let me do that again okay right there and then I'm going to go and try not to wreck my washi Come on. Do this here. Because this is going to give me plenty of space for doing some writing. So that's good. So yeah, so that there we go. There's another adorable page. And I see that I am going to have to... Do a little trimming or it's not going to fit. There we go. Yeah, I really like that a lot. And then, like I said, it comes over here and you have, um, you have more space here for a tip in. So that's great. Yeah, I'm really happy with that. I think I'll stop there. I could probably just keep going forever and ever, but I love this so much. And then, and then over here was the other pages that I did, and I'm really happy about them. They make this so pretty, and I can keep doing more and making this into just a really gorgeous journal. So, 34 minutes. So, bye.